What do you anticipate being able to do with storytelling going into the future with this new technology that you wouldn't be able to do or be able to do as well with the previous generation of audio animatronic technology? Well, if you think of, you know, I think the Johnny Depp figure we did is an extraordinary example of the old technology, but he has to perform without too much emotion. You know, it's just sort of a flat performance. And the more character you get, say if we're doing Country Bear Jamboree today, Basically, it's just a frozen face that's you know, mouthing or miming. Uh, what we're excited about, and again, in, in the range of Mr. Lincoln here, it's subtlety. You know, so it'll, we'll probably start to see uh, the uh, nuances when people start doing their HD stuff in there, <laughs> and then it comes up on YouTube. But you know, we know it's there. We know the capabilities this gives us. So to add emotion to performance is a huge thing. I mean, for an actor not to be able to emote, and where we've been able to compensate for that in the past is a, a great uh, animator like Mark Davis who worked you know, here at Disneyland for uh, the, the golden years. Mark would do staging in which the storytelling was so obvious in the way it was staged that he, didn't, he knew he wouldn't be able to rely too much on changing expressions and so forth like that. that uh, you'd get it down pat in that the way the, the characters work together, just looking at it would tell the story. And it isn't that we'd abandon that, but you know, to be able to add then the depth of being able to actually perform and go from, you're not gonna see this, but when we were playing with this, we had Lincoln, you know, after he did this little speech, kind of cracking up and doing a full range of like, how they do, that was pretty good, you know, and uh, it was absolutely fascinating, but there's no way we can use that in this show. Oh, come on. But, you know, <laughs> this show is not, uh, this show is, you know, again, it's about, we're really trying to, to deliver a message and, and, a, and a, an understanding of what, of, of Lincoln's situation and what he was going through, which at the time was a pretty, you know, dire, tense situation, so this isn't. You'll see the emotion, that, that heart, that uh, warmth, you know, it's, it's there in the face, which it, it wasn't really there before. It was so we, we can do more than, the, 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 the technology can emote in a, in a wider range than what we're going to see today. I mean, we can talk for uh, you know, hours about the work that we're doing in advance, you know, at Imagineering we're never done innovating, that's, you know, it's a constant process for us. So. Um, the work we're doing in dimensional animation, the other animatronics, our new automatronics, which are uh, dimensional figures that are aware and reactive um, in uh, new ways of, of freeing them so they can become mobile. And that they can recognize the audience. They can recognize the audience. They can so I'm going to hit him up to fix Indy at the end of the Indy ride. <laughs> I hope you like the one we did at the start of the Indy ride. We're going to do the one at the end of the Indy ride. We, we can talk for hours about yeah. all that. and, and um, um, you know, I would just say stay tuned because we are absolutely not ever pausing in our relentless pursuit of, of, of bringing care, finding new and, and more compelling ways to bring our characters and stories to life.